Um, so I go to Belgium on the 20th and then um, that show's on the 24th and then the opening in Paris is on the 28th. So, so this is your second show with Gallery Lens? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I did one last year and then um, this will be my f like first solo. I did two man show with Geordie last year and then, yeah, so then they, they take you, if they like you, work into Montevideo, into the, the bigger space. How long have you been working on these works for? A um, couple of months, but like quite, it came together quite fast. Like it was a bit of an adjustment to um, to like different studio spaces and I'm used to like kind of a bit more isolation and all that sort of thing. So it was it was a bit of an adjustment, but it's been it's good. I, I kind of like Sydney. I thought I'd hate it, but I, <laughs> I, I've, I've liked it. I Why feel. did you think you hate it? Oh, it's just... I don't know, it's different to, to Melbourne. But then, like, I've been making work in all different places and, like, you know, sometimes you make a, like, work in New York or, like, in um, Athens I made the work for Belgium. So, like, you kind of just switch in with the different cities. So I think earlier I was very attached to, like, my studio and it being this, like, where I have to make the work there. Now it's sort of, I feel like I've got, like, I can break, break out of that and... And, and also like moving in with my partner Kate, it's been good too, because that's like normalized things a little bit. So I'm trying to be a bit more nine to five instead of like nine at night to five in the morning. So yeah. just trying to adjust that kind of thing. So it doesn't matter how big the studio is for you? This has been like a bit of an adjustment in terms of like, I make, a, like I'm pretty clean, but I do make a fair bit of mess. Like, so it's smaller. I, I know when I get back from Paris, I'm gonna get a, a bigger space and that sort of thing so because the next two shows next year are quite big so if I had 12 bigger paintings like it's there's no room for like anything so the other one in Lawn was a big big barn and it was very like it's just so cold like coming back from Europe in summer and then trying to work there I was just like nah I can't handle the cold anymore so but I do like the separation of going somewhere to a studio because I find like you know you get just jump on YouTube and watch Dr. Phil or something. And like, <laughs> you know, then you can like go and make some noodles and you're like, before you know it, it's three in the afternoon and then I've got to like start pumping out works. It's good. And plus they're always here. So you're kind of like always like walking past and being like, oh, that looks a bit shit. So mm. like I'll have to, you know, fix up whatever. But yeah, so good luck with yeah, your trip. And I'm sure it's going to be a huge hit. <laughs> we'll see, we'll see. But yeah, hopefully it goes okay.